Hello, how's everybody doing this weekend? Hello to all the star seeds out there and the children of light. Um, I just wanted to come on really quick um, because I was watching um, a YouTube channel and it's called Our Everyday Lives. And um, there was something that came up today. Uh, Michael had mentioned an explosion in New York City. So I live in New Jersey. Um, and also Michael is from, is from New York. So I just wanted to look into that really quickly. And my feeling with the dream that he had, uh, I think that first of all, there are a lot of people from New York pouring into New Jersey and it's possible that they have may, may have picked up on something that was a possibility. You know, maybe they picked up on that subconsciously. So that could be the reason why they moved, they've been pouring into New Jersey, um, you know, among other reasons. Um, but anyway, I wanted to look into that and to see if there's any truth to that, if that is like a possibility of happening. So I'm going to tune in. Okay, so what I did get, um, which is the first card, which is, oh, I'm sorry, which is the hangman, which is represents the question. So to me, what that states is that it was stepped back and it was stopped from happening. And also the possibility that this could have happened or maybe it's scheduled to happen on a different timeline. That could also be a possibility. But it looks like it was it's it was stopped from happening. And so now we have the outcome, which is the four of uh, wands which is like a breakthrough card. So again, um, I think this could also represent, this could have happened, you know, may have happened or was scheduled to happen on a different timeline, uh, not on our timeline. Because this is more like a happy card. It's a, you know, uh, more of like a, um, breakthrough card and you know it's a positive card so I mean as you can see you know there could have been interference from the good guys the white hats um so then we have the next card which is this is the the past so this is the seven of swords and it represents more of a strategy um and planning and again, this is like, he's kind of like stepping away from something or he's, you know, he's um, moving away from something. And it's, to me, he's looking back. So it's looking at the past. So the plan could have very well been in the past, but was, you know, step back. So then we have um, the present, which is the hermit card, um, major arcana card. So I believe definitely this is a confirmation that there was some kind of interference uh, with this plan from the bad guys, um, because these this card represents the guardians, the human guardians, and which is us in the future. Um, which are, it's it's our future selves, our higher selves that are helping us now. So 
definitely um, somebody or, or, you know, a group of people stepped in, you know, it could have also been the intergalactics, intergalactic people, off-worlders that stepped in and changed, changed everything. Uh, and then we have the future, which you can see like this represents a city. You could see the city in the background. So we have like the six of uh, pentacles or sorry, four of pentacles. And um, I think what really would will, will happen is more of a financial change with New York City probably a new system in place, a new way of doing things, a new way of, you know, maybe a new currency, but there's something and it's being held back right now. It hasn't, it's there, but it hasn't come about in full force. But I'm definitely not getting that there's going to be an explosion. Um, and then we have the clarifiers. And we have this wish card. So I don't believe that this tower represents an explosion. Um, I think that the tower represents a new system coming into place, like the old system collapsing and then a new system. And then you have the cups here, which is, you know, especially this one, which is like, you know, a, a desire emotional fulfillment. And I think it has to do more on a financial level rather than, you know, on something being literally destroyed. Like, I don't, I really don't see that. And especially if you're on a higher frequency, if you're tuning into, um, you know, the higher dimensions, if you're keeping yourself on higher frequencies, you know, I don't see that on, our, on on the timeline, on our timeline happening. I see it more as a positive, especially with this card. So that is all. And I just wanted to come on really quick. And so if you resonate with what I've just said, you know, please uh, subscribe, like, and share and make a comment if you wish. And thank you so much for tuning in and you have a, you know, I wish everybody a great weekend. Thank you so much.